Hi friends, in this video I am going to discuss electronic devices and circuits, regulated power supply, regulated power supply, RPS, regulated power supply. This regulated power supply needs a rectifier, filter and regulator. That means regulated power supply is combination of a rectifier, filter and regulator okay so the regulator power supply circuit have rectifier filter regulator first of all re rectifier what is the purpose of this rectifier what is the function of this rectifier it is used to convert ac into dc it is used to convert ac into dc and that output dc is fed to the filter is fed to the filter what is the function of this filter we know that Filter is a circuit which removes unwanted ripples in the waveform. Which, which removes unwanted ripples in the waveform. And uh, the, uh, that, uh, the output of the filter is uh, fed to the regulator. What is the function of this regulator? It maintains constant voltage. It maintains voltage as constant. It, ma it maintains voltage as constant. Okay. This is the total circuit of regulated power supply. Okay, that means uh, if we give AC input to the regulated power supply, the output is constant DC voltage. The output is constant DC voltage. Okay, regulated power supply circuit has rectifier, filter, and regulator. Okay, what is the function of this rectifier? It is used to convert. AC into DC and the DC is fed to the filter and this filter uh, removes unwanted ripples in the waveform. So after this uh, the output is fed to the regulator. This regulator maintains the output voltage as constant and so we can get constant output DC voltage constant output DC voltage that means if we give AC input to the uh, re regulated power supply that is RPS then we can get the constant DC output we can get the constant DC output and next one ripple factor very very important one ripple factor what is ripple factor ripple factor equal to RMS value of AC component by value of DC component uh, ripple factor equal to RMS value of AC component by value of DC component and next one important term transformer utilization factor transformer utilization factor TUF TUF equal to power in DC by VA rating of transformer VA rating of transformer that is power in AC so transformer utilization factor tuf equal to pdc by pac or pdc by va rating of transformer that is volt ampere rating of transformer okay as i explained in uh, electrical specialization transformer uh, we can measure the transformer in va or volt ampere or kva kilo volt ampere okay volt ampere or kilo volt ampere so the VA rating, the rating of the transformer is in VA or KVA. So your transformer utilization factor equal to PDC by VA rating of transformer. That is PAC. P means power. Here peak inverse voltage, PIV. It is the maximum reverse voltage that a diode can withstand without destroying the junction. Peak inverse voltage is nothing but it is the maximum reverse voltage that a diode can withstand without destroying the junction without destroying the junction okay and here i am giving uh, one important table and com uh, important table regarding to rectifiers and their uh, rectifiers, efficiencies, ripple factors, form factors, PIVs, 
ट्रिपल फ्रीक्वेंसी ईडीसी वीडीसी अंड ईआरएमएस वीआरएमएस अंड नंबर आफ् डयोड्स आर् यूज अंड ट्रांसफार्मर यूटेशन फैक्टर दिस टेबल इज वेरी 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 इंपारटेंट फॉर आल द कांपटेटिव एग्जाम ओके हियर वन पर्टिकुलर्स आर् नथिंग बट हियर वाट इज द पर्टिकुलर अंड दे द रेक्टिफयर यूज दट इज हाफ वेव रेक्टिफयर आर् फुल वेव रेक्टिफयर इन केस आफ फुल वेव रेक्टिफयर इट इज सेंटर टैप आर् ब्रिड रेक्टिफयर ओके फस्ट आफ आल मैक्सीम एफिशियसी मैक्सीम एफिशियसी इफ यू यूज हाफ वेव रेक्टिफयर द मैक्सीम एफिशियसी इज फार्टी पॉइंट सिक्स पर्सेंट फार्टी पॉइंट सिक्स पर्सेंट इफ यू यूज फुल वेव रेक्टिफयर वित् सेंटर टैप फुल वेव रेक्टिफयर वित् सेंटर टैप वी कैन गेट मैक्सीम एफिशियसी इज एटी वन पॉइंट टू पर्सेंट इफ यू यूज ब्रिड रेक्टिफयर दट इज एटी वन पॉइंट टू सो सेम In case of full wave rectifier, center tap fringe rectifier uh, for maximum efficiency same. Maximum efficiency for center tap and the bridge rectifier. In case of full wave rectifier, it is same. Okay, eighty one point two percent. Coming to the ripple factor, if we use half wave rectifier, the ripple factor is one point two one. Ripple factor is one point two one. If we use full wave rectifier, it is zero point four eight. If we use the center tap or bridge rectifier, the रिपुल फैक्ट्री इज सेम जीरो पॉइंट फोर एट जीरो पॉइंट फोर एट नेक्स्ट वन इंपारटेंट आर फॉर्म फैक्टर फॉर्म फैक्टर इफ यू यूज हाफ एव रेक्टिफाइड द फॉर्म फैक्टर इज वन पॉइंट फाइव सेवन वन पॉइंट फाइव सेवन फॉर फुल फॉर फुल वेव रेक्टिफाइड द फॉर्म फैक्टर इज वन पॉइंट डबल वन बोथ टू सेंटर टैप एंड ब्रिज रेक्टिफाइड इट इज वन पॉइंट डबल वन द फॉर्म फैक्टर फॉर फुल वेव रेक्टिफाइड इज वन पॉइंट डबल वन फॉर हाफ एव रेक्टिफाइड इज वन पॉइंट फाइव सेवन वन पॉइंट फाइव सेवन and the peak inverse voltage peak inverse voltage for half wave rectifier is only v max maximum voltage v max in case of full wave rectifier for center tap it is a 2 vm and for bridge rectifier it is a vm vm okay here the difference is here for center tap the piv is 2 vm for bridge rectifier it uh, piv is vm only vm only very very important peak inverse voltage for center tap for bridge rectifier for center tap it is 2 vm for bridge rectifier it is only vm and ripple frequency ripple frequency is for half wave rectifier it is only f for center tap and bridge rectifier it is 2f it is 2f okay and coming to the idc idc equal to I M by pi in case of half wave rectifier and for full wave rectifier it is 2 I M by pi 2 I M by pi for for both center tap and bridge rectifier the I D C is 2 I M by pi 2 I M by pi and V D C is same V M by pi for uh, half wave rectifier 2 V M by pi for center tap and 2 V M by pi for bridge rectifier. for bridge rectifier and coming to the irms irms is very very important irms and vrms values it is for uh, half wave rectifier it is im by 2 and uh, for center tap it is im by root 2 and bridge re- bridge type also it is im by root 2 im by root 2 for half wave rectifier it is im by 2 and for center tap and bridge rectifier it is im by root 2 and the vrms is same as that of irms that is uh, VRMS equal to VM by two here VM by root two here also VM by root two. Okay, VRMS value for half wave rectifier is VM by two for center tap and bridge rectifier it is VM by root two VM by root two and number of diodes in use number of diodes used in half wave rectifier is only one diode. In case of center tap we use two diodes. In case of bridge rectifier we use Four diodes. Very very important question. The number of diodes used used in half wave rectifier is only one diode. In case of full wave rectifier with a center tap, it is only two diodes. In case of bridge rectifier, uh, in case of full wave rectifier with the bridge type rectifier, is the number of diodes used are four diodes. Are four diodes. Okay. And the transformer utilization factor. <coughs> It is also very very important. Transformer utilization factor for half wave rectifier it is 0.287. For full wave rectifier with uh, center tap it is 0.693. For uh, 
for full wave rectifier with bridge type rectifier is 0.812 0.812 it is very very important for full wave rectifier with bridge type configuration the transformer utilization factor is 0.812 0.812 okay so the transformer utilization factor is higher value for full wave rectifier with bridge configuration with bridge configuration okay and once again the maximum efficiency is highest in full wave rectifier that is 81.2 percent for both center tap and bridge rectifier and the ripple factor is 1.21 for half wave and 0.48 for full wave rectifier and form factor is 1.57 for half wave 1.11 for full wave and peak inverse voltage vm for uh, half wave 2 vm for uh, full wave with center tap and vm for full wave with bridge type and ripple frequency is uh, only frequency f for half wave 2F for both center tap and bridge type and IDC equal to IM by pi here 2 IM by pi here 2 IM by pi PDC is same as that of IM that is VM by pi 2 VM by pi here also 2 VM by pi and IRMS are also same IM by 2 IM by root 2 IM by root 2 here VRMS equal to VM by 2 VM by root 2 VM by root 2 and the number of diodes is uh, used in uh, half air rectifier is only 1 here in case of uh, full wave rectifier with the center tap the number of diodes are 2 full wave rectifier with uh, bridge type configuration the number of diodes are 4 and the transformer utilization factor for uh, half wave rectifier it is 0 0.287 the transformer utilization factor for uh, full wave rectifier with center tap is 0 0.693 and transformer utilization factor for uh, Full wave rectifier with uh, bridge rectifier, bridge type configuration is 0 0.812, 0 0.812, okay? Okay, friends, thank you and all the best, okay?